Hi again, everyone. It's me, Emily Rossmus, Education Coordinator here at the Ned Smith Center for Nature and Art. Today, we are in the archives, and this is where all of the artwork we currently have is stored until it's ready to go on display. So whether it's something of Ned's, an original piece or a print we own, or something we're borrowing from another facility, it lives back here until it's ready to go on display in one of our galleries. Speaking of which, we're going to take a closer look at some of the galleries we have here at the center today, and that's going to be the topic of our Ned Talk. Welcome to our Ned Talk. Our largest gallery is devoted to Ned Smith himself. We have a rotating exhibit of some of the permanent artwork we have here. Next we have the Allwine Gallery, which features a rotating exhibit of nationally renowned artists. And our third gallery is the Romberger Gallery. It also features some moth and butterfly mounts, but we'll talk about those in a later talk. Right now, the artist in the Romberger Gallery is Jennifer Lynn Becker, a local artist who was inspired by nature for her series of botanical art for Native Gardens prints. And then always on display in the Romberger Gallery is our beautiful stained glass entry piece. This was designed by Bob Sopcich, a local artist who you might recognize from painting the Bass Pro murals. It was then created by some of Ned's own family, and Bob actually gained some inspiration from Ned himself. So he went out on top of the mountain and just looked out at the Susquehanna Valley, looked at the river, and kind of got an idea of what Ned would see when he was out, maybe journaling or photographing or getting some ideas for some of his artwork. So up here on the beautiful stained glass, you can see the way the Susquehanna River winds around. You can see the fields, the farm fields that Ned might have also seen. And then Bob, when he was done, he he didn't really felt like there was that little pop that it needed. And so the Cooper's Hawk that you can see all the way in the top shooting is across the sky, that's what Bob felt really, really drew the piece, um, gave the piece life and, and draw, drew it all together. The design also features some of Ned's original pen and ink illustrations, anywhere from hawks to turkeys to raccoons, deer and grouse. So next time in, you're in the area, if you've maybe been to the center but never really paid attention to the stained glass, or if you've never been, perfect opportunity to check out some of those galleries, check out our beautiful stained glass as well. This week I'll leave you with one of my favorite quotes by Ned, seeing is more than merely looking, it involves noticing things. We'll see you next time on Ned Talks.